Hi friends, welcome back to the Guitar Spa where we bring you all the beautiful guitars uh, reviewed just for you and right now I have one Taylor just arrived uh, this is a Taylor 914, the latest model, 2016 model um, and how is it different? There's no more Cindy inlay on this guitar but there are a lot of uh, tone enhancing improvement on the 2016 model and we're gonna get it started first you get the Grand Auditorium size uh, auditorium size so, uh, 16 inch wide um, these the the top is uh, the Sitka spruce top with the they call it the advanced relief route uh, um, uh, bracing pattern but actually is the Andy powers who redesigned it so you get a, a relatively t lighter top but as the forward shift has been shifted slightly up to even half inch and open wider so you get very much a lot of uh lower bottom end base as so well that the middle mids lower end mids uh and beautiful travels on this guitar i've re, re removed the hd strings and put the normal 1253 uh 53 uh, prosper bronze on this because i think it sounds a little better with more clarity because the hg strings sound too much mid-range too fat and too dark on this guitar so Sika spruce top you got the indian rosewood beautiful indian rosewood on this guitar um lovely ablon uh top purfling with the koa looks like koa uh purfling wood on this uh the whole sound hole is bound with ebony ebony bound and on this is a special you can see here the armrest which is really good because if you put your armrest here, generally if you have your normal guitar when you put your armrest There's some differences because you tend to stop the vibration when you put it on the armrest on the guitar on the low bar Well, this armrest will still to get the same sustain, same tonality that's on this guitar uh, one eleven, one three quarter nut width. You get the ES two uh, system uh, expression on this bone nut and saddle. The bone saddle is actually uh, a bleach. I've actually right now fitted a unbleached bone saddle, which gives a little bit more better tone and also um, radius it accordingly to the fretboard the radius head plate. Basically, just look at that head plate. Lovely. 900 series uh, um, head plate ebony with that lovely just like a, a, a inlay on this and behind you have the Guto 510 tuners and also the Makasa ebony um, laminate on, on this which is gloss beautiful neck system on this guitar and uh, let's listen to how it sounds with the new strings set up uh, one thing to notice you can see the braces on the back is not in this way but it's slightly this way uh, and it's braced very thin okay this is all this is the only thing that I don't really uh, like about this guitar is is because the braces are this way uh, on a few of the 800 series I've seen because the back reinforcement is not strong and especially in a high humidity uh, country like Singapore you begin you, this one is not because it's very new you will see some waves on the back of the guitar because it's so thin it's not going to reinforce it acts, acts as a tone it's good for tone but in terms of form you know function maybe uh, you probably need a better thicker higher a stronger um, braces that's that's why I think okay something also about the top is the braces are very extremely light the two tone bars on this guitar is very short and very thin and even the two sides bar sides uh, the the tone uh, the bars uh, braces here are very thin and also stop short about uh, one quarter inch from the sides that's why it sounds really uh, it has really nice bottom line on it.
one, a little bit more bottom end compared to the uh, last uh, 914 I played the, before this uh, system. <laughs> Sustain you know, on the guitar. Okay, let's couple this baby on the third fret. Really, um, very responsive after I set it up. Before that, it wasn't um, sounded muddy. The top was swelling. It was it was wet because in in the Singapore humidity, it tends uh, because the tops are thin and because it's, when once you forward shift there, then you have less structural balance here, and unless the, the braces are very thick and taut. So that's why you get slightly swelling on there and then the action goes up and you, you get less of the sustain, the clarity because once the action gets out of the sweet spot, okay, the sweet spot, the whole guitar doesn't resonate at all. I mean, it's, it, it resonates, but it doesn't resonate at in optimization. It's not at the optimized air, um, um, level.
responsive uh, sounding guitar. I really love his travels. Just a little more bottom end, as I said before. You can hear. Alright, this is the uh, 914CE. If you're in Singapore, there are two distributors uh, in Singapore. One is uh, Cinemax in uh, uh, Park Lane, uh, below basement, and the other one is Sweetie. So far, right now, if you want great prices, Cinemax has the great prices in Singapore. They, in fact, they are right now, in fact, the lowest in the whole wide world. Because uh, if you want cheap, cheap tailors, look for them. Call Cinemax. Cinemax. Look for Simon Peter. He'll give you a great deal. This is probably the cheapest I've seen in the whole wide world. And um, yeah, I mean, they are, they are, they are. It's very competitive prices because he keeps his costs low and he's trying to just. Uh, be of service to all the Singaporeans and the people around the globe. So the cheapest price in the market, 914CE Sitka Top Spruce. You got that special ebony uh, bevel that they just said, Ryan inspired, or they call it Laskin inspired. Um, very forward shift, like half inch from the sound hole. That's why you get a lot of bottom end. And also the bracings are extremely thin. So you, if you buy this in Singapore, buy a dehumidifier to dry your guitars. Um, whatever the, the manufacturer says, you don't need to dry it. Please take it from me because I've seen all the problems uh, 
or the issues with not drawing your guitar. Um, indie rules with back and back and sides. Mm -hmm. You get ebony, uh, the binding on this guitar. Um, lovely head plate, and also the inlays. The whole guitar also is bound with lovely. They call it, I think koa. Um, uh, puffing lines on this really beautiful and also extremely light lovely case really good for finger stuff like this review you actually post a comment just below this YouTube video what do you think about this uh, guitar and also I know a lot of people said um, the 900 series is just a glorified 800 series uh, let me debunk it it's nonsense totally nonsense it's not just having ornamentation you get bevel the guitar is way much lighter way more responsive uh, it has as a slightly uh, clearer travels uh, compared to the the eight one four, is more brace for finger style and also medium um, hand strumming. So uh, you really get what you pay for in life, and and the extra is not just a pretty guitar. You get a, a guitar is that has a great um, tonal improvements on this guitar so give me a like thumbs up on this guitar give me some comments i'll try to just reply to you if i can and really enjoy uh, hope you enjoy it and subscribe to this channel because it's a great channel and also you can post and get your friends to just uh, uh listen to this uh channel also and also this video so till the next video because i live passion play guitar i love joy peace health and wealth to be multiplied in your life i'll see you very soon bye bye